These are different aquaponics systems I've got set up on the front porch. I call them aquaponics because that's what most people are familiar with, but they're really bioponics, as evidenced by this vortex and filtration system that is producing a liquid fertilizer. See, it's rather frothy. Um, anyway, that's uh, that's converting biomass into liquid fertilizer teas. I transfer that to that unit out there and to these other tanks which we're raising little mollies in. I just placed those guys in there. Yeah, it's very uh, it's very dark. It's dark from the tannins and the biomass and it's dark from algae, but not much algae, not so much um, that it's a problem for the fish. Actually, the filter fish like these guys in there. Uh, mollies. Uh, they they um, they eat that algae and all the other good stuff that goes with that. This is the um, bio garden. Just set it up. I, I kind of modified the one I had before, adding an 18-inch trough here and uh, cleaning this one out, removing all the rocks that were in there, and turn these into two deep water systems. Yeah, I got a tray here. They they uh, they're doing pretty nice. This is uh, coriander, tomatoes, and um, uh, three different lettuces that I had from the city of refuge. Did a little transplanting. We'll see how they do in these cups. Um, this level is under is directly exposed under the sun. You can see your vortex aerator. Our prototype doing quite well. Yep, and that's hyper aerating everything. And so, yeah, we've got uh, two 18 inch deep water troughs, which are going to be a lot more convenient than working with stones. Stones, stones, stones are, uh, they're great for microbes and for anchoring plants, but when that's not necessary, um, as in this case, uh, we'll, uh, uh, we'd be happy to do without them. So anyway, that's what's going on in and around here. Thanks for checking us out, and uh, stay tuned, and we'll show you the progress as the summer unfolds.